Hey guys, let's do the unboxing of infamous Samsung Z Fold 5, share my first impressions and buy or sell opinion. Quick disclaimer, this is by no means a sponsored promotional video, views, thoughts and opinions expressed solely belong to me but anyone. Let's see what we got here. It's not just a box, it's a black box. Let's unbox it. Use a manual. I'm not much of a reader, so it's a hard pass. Sorry pal. Let's fire it up baby. Don't feel intimidated. I know we have a lot to cover, but that's okay, you know, one step at a time. Aesthetics wise, a minor overhaul compared to its previous version, Z Fold 4. The most significant change you will notice is that it folds super flat. There is no gap around the hinge when folded thanks to the revolutionary new hinge design. Yeah, speaking of which, Z Fold 5 is 10 grams lighter versus Z Fold 4 thanks to the new water drop hinge design and speaker size is also shrunken and weighs just 253 grams versus 263 grams Z Fold 4. It's not significant but yeah it's substantial. To put things into perspective it's about the same size I mean the same weight as the notorious drone from DJI mini lineups. Flashlight position is changed versus the very bottom position on Z Fold 4. Our display is 6.2 inch dynamic AMOLED 120Hz refresh rate. On the flip side, inner displays a whopping 7.6 inch dynamic AMOLED 120Hz adaptive refresh rate. The crease is ultra low and barely visible to naked eye when compared to its predecessor, the Z Fold 4. Let's talk about the new slim pen. You will notice a massive weight cut thanks to the Ozempic shots. I mean jokes apart. On a serious note, it takes your productivity to the next level. With just a push of a button, you can write and draw with precision. It's definitely must have accessory to add to your portfolio. On the flip side, talking about insights, the processor is Snapdragon 8 Gen 2. It comes in three memory sizes, 256 gig, 512 gig, and one TB, 12 GB RAM, dual SIM support, one physical sim and one eSIM. Wireless charging standard is QI, turbo hey, charging, yeah. Wi-Fi 6E, time. Bluetooth and NFC support, and obviously 5G network. It does support wireless hey, power share. It's you can time. charge other Samsung devices like watch, headphones, hey, so yeah. on and so forth. It's Speaking time. of battery, it got the same 4400 mAh battery size as Z Fold 4, but the battery life got a big boost thanks to the new blazing fast Snapdragon 8 Gen 2 processor. Massive gain in the camera quality. You might be scratching your heads and thinking that the camera specs are exactly the same as Z Fold 4, but the answer is yes and no. To keep it simple, yes, the camera is the same, but Z Fold 5 leverages the new AI powered image signal processing algorithm to capture way more crisper images, even under low light conditions. Front camera is 10 megapixel and 4 megapixel under display main. Rear camera is 50 megapixel wide and 12 megapixel ultra wide, 10 megapixel tele. 3x optical zoom and 30x space zoom it also supports 4k and 8k video recording how cool is that amazing immersive gaming experience thanks to its new snapdragon 8 gen 2 processor and 120 hertz adaptive refresh rate on this massive 7.6 inch inner display it also supports Samsung DeX for laptop slash PC like experience when connected to a monitor or PC. It's an absolute beast and is more like a mini PC that sits right in your pocket. You can do multitasking like edit docs, PowerPoint slides, play games thanks to the blazing fast Snapdragon 8 Gen 2 processor. Samsung even released a new purple color edition wireless buds 2 pro they look amazing and very adorable moment of truth guys keep it or toss it it's a matter of personal choice i will definitely try out since it's a premium flagship phone from Samsung great camera quality massive main display way more faster thanks to the blazing fast Snapdragon 8 Gen 2 processor great for gaming also acts as a powerful PC in dex mode when connected to a monitor thank you so much guys for making it to the very end of the video I hope this video was very informative let me know your thoughts in the comments below consider subscribing to my channel if you haven't already yet and also smash the like button really appreciate your support guys be kind and keep rocking see you in the next one peace